Before we get this video underway, I wanted to show you guys, check out my brand new Avenged One shirt. It's your boy, wearing your boy. <laughs> so yeah, it's me, Stra it's, it's me, it's me, it's me, Strawberry in the scarf. <sighs> For all of you who don't know, I have a Twitter. And I've had a Twitter for quite a while now, for at least a few years, and I have, God, let's see here, almost 17,000 tweets. I'm a little bit shy of 17,000 tweets. Now, that is a lot of thoughts. Granted, a lot of these tweets may be retweets that weren't originally my thoughts or just YouTube videos that I have liked, but a fair amount of these tweets are my genuine thoughts on the world, on society, on myself, on pretty much anything that I can think of at the time, because if I have a dumb thought, where do I go? I go straight to social media for the world to see it, as everybody does nowadays. And as a lot of you may know who do follow me on Twitter, I have a lot of very, very dumb thoughts, and I don't necessarily think about what I'm saying before I write it. For example, just today itself, let's take a look at some of the stupid ass tweets that I've wrote. And I'm pretty sure there's been something stupid because I say something stupid every day. Here's one right now, and I know you guys are gonna give me hell for this. It says, can we change the term from committed suicide to performed a suicide? Because it sounds much more fancy that way. <laughs> that's not right, that's, that's kind of fucked up actually. And I, I tweeted that, like I just was like, yep, this is something that the world needs to know that I thought, and let me just put that out here. And then to follow up with myself, I put, on that note, can we change the term performed performed cunnilingus to committed cunnilingus because that seems like a big commitment my mom follows me on this program <laughs> on this social media my mom and my brother follow me and i'm just like fuck it i'm gonna say this why <laughs> here's one that doesn't even make sense for me it says if you sit still at night for long enough and really focus yourself your body will start shaking weird haha <laughs> I don't even know what that means, I don't even remember trying that, but apparently I was like, I gotta write this, the, like the world's gotta know this shit. So without further ado, I thought it'd be fun today to sit down with you guys, yours truly, that doesn't make sense, and look through some stupid tweets that have just circulated throughout the world. So without further ado, let's get into there, in, in, let's get, let's, let's do that thing. Wait, wait, I wanna do one more take. Let's do it! Here's a good one, here's a good one by my baby girl Trisha, by my baby girl Trisha. I'd rather kill myself than commit suicide. I'd rather kill myself than commit suicide. First of all, it's I would rather kill myself, duh. And second of all, and second of all, it's perform suicide, Trisha. Thank you so much. I like this one right here. This one's this one's excellent. Because what you think what you see is not what you think it would be. I want my first daughter to be a girl. Happy content face heart. Okay. Okay, first of all guys, how dare you? Maybe her first daughter could be a boy. It's 2017 after all, how dare you? Shame on you, you assume that baby's gender, fuck you. My sister is pregnant? I cannot wait to find out if I'm gonna be an auntie or an uncle. I have bad news for you. That depends on what you feel you are on the inside. That depends on what you feel you are on the inside. Just like the last lady. Don't let nobody define your baby for you. You define yourself a, a baby. That's the face of an uncle though, if you ask me. That's the face of an uncle. Everybody's favorite Kourtney Kardashian asks the world, Do ants have dicks? Yes, Kourtney. They do have dicks. They all have dicks. Big dicks. Big dicks, Kourtney. Is Stevie Wonder really still blind? No, he for a little bit there, for a little bit there, he was actually able to see again. And then he came out to the real world and he decided, oh shit, there's some stupid people here. And then he gouged his eyes out again. He was like, fuck this shit. Okay, this isn't really a stupid tweet, but I just saw this shit and this is probably the funniest fucking shit I've ever seen. <laughs> so he was like, so my uncle got a drone and now he's fucking with people. And he's got the Grim Reaper hanging around the drone. <laughs> I would so go to my grandma's house and just hang there right in front of the window and I have a like a loudspeaker Grandmama Your time is coming. I probably shouldn't say grandmother. I'd be like I'd be like Deborah Deborah your time is soon Deborah your time is soon Walk with me into the shadows of hell I'm so glad I live in the USA and not America because America is so stupid and annoying Girly girl, I got a surprise for you. Welcome to the United States 
of Africa. You good. You are good. You are good. Because, um, you're definitely right there. You're definitely right. That was a bad joke. Cut. Cut. Cut from the video. Cut. I didn't cut it, did I? I probably didn't cut it. Fuck. I want a pet turquoise. Me too. I've always wanted a pet turquoise. I'd name him Jimmy. Jimmy the turquoise. We'd be best friends. We'd gallop through fields of flowers. We'd love each other forever. Until one day, a hawk would swoop down and steal Jimmy from me. And I would never see Jimmy again. Until one day, I'm walking down the street with my children by my side. I think that's the end. I have never even thought of Jimmy for years. And I see a hawk fly by. I see it fly by. And a turd comes out of its asshole. The turd slowly descends onto me hits me in my chest and explodes in inside J J Jimmy is that you J Jimmy I love him so much I bring him to my lips and I kiss him Jimmy I haven't seen you in years it's good to have you back <laughs> the, this one from our from our current president I love this he says he says the fun a lot of people hate Donald Trump and I understand why you hate him I get it I get it everyone has an entitlement to hate everyone but you gotta admit the man says some funny shit the man says some funny shit maybe I'm old-fashioned but I don't like seeing women in combat C call me old-fashioned but maybe I just love having slaves he should have just said that <laughs> What the fuck? Jesus Christ. I'm gonna get in trouble for that joke, aren't I? Yep. Call me old-fashioned, but every now and then I like to give a Native American a nice blanket. If you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm... If you catch my drift. If you know what I'm saying. You know, I like to fucking kill Native Americans in my free time. Call me old-fashioned, but once a year I like to decapitate a man at the top of a great mound, have his blood drip down the steps to yield good crops this year. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to die from dysentery. <laughs> I don't like my jokes. Why do the women never have to have a DNA test to see if the baby is theirs? Why? Why, huh? Huh? That's bullshit, huh? Men's rights. Men's rights. What the fuck? This is bullshit. I am triggered. Triggered. It's so weird how the majority of pedophiles turn out to be teachers. Well, let's just see what's in here. You're not a teacher. You're a cat. These jokes are just grade A, grade A, because it's a file. <sighs> just ate three condoms. Now I'll never be pregnant, no matter how much I swallow. I don't even know what to say about that one. What's even more important, if you take a look at this photo right here, if this is her phone, and I hope to God it's not, she's at 6% battery. Okay, she was like, yo, my phone's about to die, dog. Oh, shit, I need to charge this motherfucker. Okay, hold on, one second. I just had an idea. I just ate three condoms. Now I'll never get pregnant. I just gotta let the world know this. This is important to me. I gotta tell the world right now that I just ate three condoms so I can't get pregnant. I mean, how else, how else am I gonna prevent anything like that? You can't get pregnant through your stomach. Yet! I just can't get over that one time Sean Spicer tweeted out his fucking Twitter password and then he did it one more time. <laughs> and if you take a look at the dates, they were like the back to back. They were within two day period. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright guys, that was just going to be a, a quick little video. I'm actually all out of time for this video. Um, so thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this little idea, um, cool that's good to know I actually got a similar idea from my friend uh, zesty topad I want you guys to go check him out I don't want to steal his format at all without giving him any credit so I'm gonna put his link in the channel he was doing some Meverse stuff and he did a lot of funny stuff and his formats probably a thousand times better than mine so you definitely need to go check out zesty topad uh, my friend Noah he's the best he's the greatest he's the sexy redheaded motherfucker of my dreams so thank you all so much for watching I really hope you all enjoyed the video and until next time I'm a vengeful.